just in case you guys were wondering, this is gonna be good footage. Morning. I am uh, going to get going on this shower drain and the pan and uh, concrete. So I'm just going to drill my hole for the drain. I'm going to go under the van and look and see you know, where I can drill it. Shoot a pilot hole down first to make sure it's clear. And then I'll uh, drill the main hole, set the drain in there. Let's get started. This is the drain I'm using. It's for tile. They give you a two by inch and a half bushing. Stick it in there, obviously with glue. I'm just gonna drill a hole large enough for an inch and a half pipe, maybe a two inch. My plywood will be carved out from there, so that'll sit in the holes, and then the membrane will come into it, cut a hole in it. The drill bit I'm using is 732s. I have a mark here, I went under. I went on the underside, and there's a main beam, like right here. So I'm gonna be over here with my drain. I'm probably actually gonna drill it here, not there, but we'll shoot the pilot through, see where it ends up. You see daylight. Let's go check, see where it is. <coughs> there it is there. So, as I checked under there, it's a little too close to the outside. That won't be my center. I'm gonna move it back just a hair, so it's gonna be somewhere around there. This is the bit I want to use to actually drill through the metal. Actually, I might drill this one first, and then I'll shoot the little one through. off, new girl on. Somebody stop me. You got a shower drain. Piece of cake. It's all cleaned up and I've cut my first piece of shower liner. I throw PL under it just to hold it down and then I'll use my stapler to staple it up on the on the edges here. Let's start setting it. So any water that gets past the concrete is gonna get down through there. Where's my drain? I'm gonna make this low as I can make it. Ready for concrete, gotta go mix it. This is the sand mix. 
No stone. Water. That uh, concrete all done. Hello, it's another day. And this time we got the van in a new spot and Willie's already out here working. Mm. Frozen. Unreal. I've just started on the back wall there doing the uh doing the cedar. Pretty good, Bob. Check it out. Just did that cedar wall. No way. What are you? I thought you were gonna put the shelf in. I no. missed the cedar. Can I think I might go for a walk. Let's go for a walk on the lake. Oh my gosh, it's good. It smells really good. Are you wearing a mask? Yeah, I haven't, I haven't trimmed my nose hairs in a while. Oh my god. <laughs> and your lungs are gonna hurt later. No, they won't. They already do. I'm Can't hurt like, later if they already hurt. <laughs> yeah, let's go for an, for an ice walk. Yeah. Okay, let's go. You want me to jump off here? <gasps> Be outside! You wanna go for a walk? You wanna go for a walk? You wanna go for a walk? Except for when we both go through the ice. This chick's got life jackets. <laughs> Never seen something like this in my life. <laughs> Going for a walk on the ice, she's got a life jacket. <laughs> in case we fall through. God. Wow, what's the Beautiful out here today. What's more useful, my life jackets or your weird pickaxe thing? Let's ask the people. What's more likely to save your life as you fall through crashing ice? This. <laughs> I'm falling through, I stab like this the ice and pull myself out. The life jackets, what, help you float underneath the ice? <laughs> Willie thinks I brought both these life jackets out for both of us. But really, I just brought them out for me. <laughs> this is Titanic style. I <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna leave you off the door. I'll never let go, Jack. Yep. Whoa.